All right, Chris, thank you. Developing news tonight, jobs are on the line in Isabella County after voters rejected an operation millage in February. Democracy spoke, but now jobs, again, are on the line. And some of those jobs are the positions of those who protect and serve. The Board of Commissioners held a meeting today to discuss next steps, and TV5's James Felton was there. He joins us live with what was brought to the table. James? And that meeting wrapped up about three hours ago here at the commission. On aging, and the DOC would not go into specifics on who would lose their jobs today. But it's clear that the Isabella County Sheriff's Office Road Patrol would be on the chopping block. Sheriff Michael Main said the Road Patrol is a critical function to the community, on average responding to 200 to 300 incidents a week, around 16,500 incidents per year. Maine tells us his office is the only 24-7 operation in the county with at least two deputies on every shift. Maine said he can't wrap his head around what it would look like if the road patrol is wiped out. The numbers that they're looking at and the level of cut includes um, all 19 deputies under my, my um, um, authority, and that is the detectives, the sergeants, and all the road patrol. So as expected, the morale is... Uh, um, <laughs> very, very low, but I'm going to be, I'm going to be very honest. Um, the deputies have, we've had good conversations. They're like, some of them are saying we're, we're in it to the end. We're in it till we're all the way to the end. Others are like, you know, and I, and I can't blame them. Others are like, I may have to look. There's no way we can come to a balanced budget without reductions in that service. I'm hoping that uh, there's a chance that we can put the public safety uh, millage on the, the ballot, but it's going to be dependent upon what support do we have in the community. And we're hoping to hire a, a contractor to take a look at, at that and give us some feedback. And the board said if the road patrol is eliminated, it would trim almost $2 million off of next year's budget. The board is aiming to have all the cuts approved by May at the latest. Reporting live and local in Isabella County, James Felton, WNEM, TV5. And the Sheriff's Office says those layoffs will be effective September 30th of this year.